What's up everyone, Tim here from Everyday Tactical Vids and today we're taking a look at the Survival Tabs. Their website is thesurvivaltabs.com and essentially what you have here is a meal replacement option in a little tablet like this. So if you're familiar with like Neko wafers, that candy uh, that was pretty popular a while ago or maybe you know something the size, maybe twice the size I would say, of like a Tums tablet. Uh, that's essentially what this is. So a serving size is actually 12 of these and in a serving you're going to get about 240 calories, lots of different vitamins and minerals and things like that. Uh, the idea behind the entire you know, kind of concept here, uh, it originated with astronauts because they were concerned when astronauts first went up into space that they weren't going to be able to effectively digest their food and so they created this uh, item instead. Now these things are, um, they have a variety of different flavors right in front of you. We have strawberry, we have vanilla. I actually had and had some uh, friends try out butterscotch yesterday and then over here we have the uh, chocolate option as well. And um, what, th what you're going to basically do is you're going to eat a bunch of these and they're going to serve as a meal replacement. The reason that they are kind of promoted as a good option for people who are into survival, outdoor stuff, is that they have a very long shelf life. So they're saying about 25 years for your shelf life. And that's at normal temperatures, low temperatures, or very high temperatures. They haven't found much deterioration regardless of what the, uh, regardless of what the temperature is. So um, you can buy them over at thesurvivaltabs.com. Um, they do have different sizes. You have the containers here. You got bags here. Then you have the smaller packs here. I will. I do want to remind you. So you get four in, in one of these packs, four in one of those packs. So you're going to have to get three packs to have a full serving again, which is 12 of the tabs. I did eat some of these yesterday. Uh, yeah, yesterday was. Tried them out. Uh, they're, I wouldn't say they're absolutely delicious, but they're quite good, way better than I thought they were going to be, to be honest with you. And uh, I'll try this one. We'll see what my uh, face looks like on camera, see if I wince or if I look like I'm going to be sick. Uh, I don't think so, because the butterscotch one was actually pretty good. And then we'll uh, give you some thoughts on, you know, maybe where you might want to use these as far as a, uh, an item for, you know, crisis situations that pop up, storms hit your house, you lose power, you got no food, uh, backpacking, wilderness survival. Okay, so as I mentioned, I did have uh, one of these yesterday. I actually had, let's see, three other friends, or at least two other friends, try them yesterday, and they were like, yeah, pretty good. I think everybody expected them to be like really chalky, real, really terrible. The butterscotch definitely tasted like butterscotch. Uh, one thing worth noting that they do have right here on the packet, so uh, they're non-GMO, so they're basically much healthier than something that's got all kinds of, you know, it's been uh, genetically modified, and it's gluten-free. So if you've got gluten issues, not going to be a problem when you have these... Uh, when you have these tabs. So let me try this chocolate one right here on camera. Tell you what that. They're definitely, um, I wouldn't call them juicy. They're definitely going to be on the chalkier side of things. But definitely has a chocolate flavor. And um, Brian over at Survival on Purpose. I'm going to chew this here real quick. Wash it down with some highly genetically modified organisms here, um, Mountain Dew. Brian, who's over at Survival On Purpose, another YouTube channel, talks about wilderness survival and gear reviews and stuff like that. He, uh, if I remember correctly, he basically said, you know, don't eat bugs. Instead, you can eat this, which is, is true. These are, you know, you're going to get good, uh, good nutrition out of this, and it's probably safer, safer than eating a lot of the things that you might find out there if you don't know what it is. could be poisonous, blah, blah, blah. So, chocolate. Yeah, it's good. Uh, it's not amazing. I wouldn't want to eat it for dessert every day, but um, from quite tasty, I would say. Let's actually zoom in here and show you some of the nutritional information in the uh, survival tabs. There is a lot of information on the back here from the top all the way to the bottom. Let me give you some of the core things. Again, in 12 tabs, 240 calories, 108 calories from fat. You got 12 grams of total fat, 3 grams of saturated, um, 140 milligrams of your sodium, which is 6%, your total carbs, 30 grams, and 4 grams of protein. 100% of your vitamin A, 20% of your calcium, 100% of your vitamin C, 100% of your iron, 100% of your vitamin D. 100% uh, of your vitamin B12, 100% of your folic acid, 100% of your niacin, 100% of your vitamin E. So you can see there's lots of nutritional value uh, in these items. So, you know, uh, when you think about actually, you know, using one of these or purchasing one of these, you're going to be getting, as you can see, uh, quite a bit of good stuff out of it. It's not like you're just eating something that's all carbs or all just, you know, sugar. There's lots of other things that they've actually put into these survival tabs. 
So let's be a little more specific here. Where would I use something like this? Well, um, would I throw something like this in a backpack if I was going for a day hike? Yeah, maybe. If I'm going to pack something that's got, you know, 240 to maybe two servings, because you have two full servings in one of these bags. So 12 tabs is a serving. There's 24 tabs in one of these bags. So let's say 500-ish calories. Would I take this? Uh, possibly. Probably I'd take something like, you know, Cliff Bars, Protein Bars, that type of thing. Um, even a bunch of granola bars, some trail mix, that type of food for your average day hike. Now, what I would do though, is I would, uh, you know, make this nice and compact and then leave it in a pack. So that if I ever went out hiking, I was like, oh man, I forgot to bring, or I ate all my food and then I was stuck out in the woods for a while because of some crisis situation. Now I do have a form of, uh, of nutrition that's going to last. So even if I forget it's in the bag, it's still there. So, you know, backpacking, hiking, hiking certainly applications in that way. Uh, wilderness survival, yeah, you know, if you're out working on some bushcraft skills, you're not going to be out in the woods testing your skills, you know, doing an extended stay in wilderness survival. Uh, it's nice to have something like this, maybe some of these smaller packs, in case you do get into a crisis situation and you're over your head and you're like, okay, I've bit off more than I can chew, I need some food to actually sustain myself, now you can have something like this. I normally, uh, you know, would test all the different packages and stuff, but I'm saving this one, this one, and these two, and they're going into my uh, storage here at the house so that we're going to keep them for as long as we need, um, basically as a emergency ration for our family. So uh, I'm a believer in them enough. They taste good enough. It seems like they have nutritional uh, value, and also they're backed up by uh, the the long term, the longevity of them. You know. You know, for this type of product review, you know, I'm not going to go on baton with these things. You know, I'm not going to cut down a tree or make a bodro with it. It's food. It tastes decent. Um, it's got nutritional value. So that's what I'm going to say about it. These are something that you may wanna, might want to add uh, to a kit. You might want to add this to some of the rations that you store in your house. But check them out online. Again, thesurvivaltabs.com. And uh, thanks for checking out this video. hope it was informative and gave you some information on another product out there that, uh, that could really help you. Thanks as always for checking out our videos here on YouTube. Please subscribe to Everyday Tactical Vids on YouTube if you've not done so already. Like us on Facebook, follow us on Twitter, check us out on Instagram and Tumblr as well. Take care.